I picked up a few things recently from the Aritzia Fall 2022 sale. So I figured I'd go through them, try them on, and just kind of talk through why I got what I got. I won't try on the socks, but just so you know, I did get some. Wilfred go to plush ankle socks, and these are the TNA base ankle socks. Unfortunately, I do love the socks from Aritzia, and I feel like I'm always stocking up or like I never have enough socks. I hadn't seen the plush socks before, so these were kind of interesting and new to me, and I feel like black socks are like what I wear the most, so no harm in picking up a couple more pairs of these. And then I liked the color variety on the TNA socks. I don't really have like any red or brownish socks and then I'm always wearing white socks. So just thought it was good to pick these up. So this is the TNA Butter Mini Bra Top in the color Kombu. And I actually already have a couple of these TNA bra tops just like this one, just in different colors. I really like these. I love wearing like sports bras, but not like super compressing bras. So these are a great investment if you are looking for something like that. They're also like a super soft, buttery material, almost like the Lululemon Align material, I think it is. I like the color. It's different from the like more neutral colors that I have. And maybe it could be like layered under something where it's like peeking out. And the other bra top I have here is the TNA Action TNA Butter hold tight bra top in just a black color so I don't really have many like v-neck bra tops so I thought this would be good to add to my collection so if I like this one I would maybe consider like getting like a nude beigey color next it is again it's that same like buttery material as the green one we have the TNA Babaton Bab <laughs> the TNA Babine mock neck in the color spiced burgundy and this is like a cropped turtleneck top um, with the turtleneck up pretty wide and then the sleeves definitely way longer than where it's gonna hit on the waist. I was really attracted to the color of this. I feel like I don't really have many red things. The colors that I mainly wear are like black. So I thought this would be a good addition, especially for the holidays. I feel like it'll just look really cute with like black pants or like a black skirt. So I wanted to pick this up. In terms of material, it's like a thin rib that we got going on here. So I like how the sleeves like fit nicely. Um, I liked the length. It's just above my belly button, if not like halfway covering it, which I like. It is lightweight, so I'll say like it could definitely be a layering piece for the winter. Um, if you could put like a cardigan or just like maybe another sweatshirt over it if you need to be extra warm. And then I have the TNA Waffle Crew Waist Long Sleeve. This is just a typical waffle knit crew neck or sort of cropped. It's like cut at the bottom like a, but it is hemmed. Um, but yeah, it's, it's going to be like more of a crop fit. Um, just a plain black long sleeve basically. I have one plain black waffle knit long sleeve from Brandy Melville, but I think it's a little too cropped at this point. I almost feel like uncomfortable wearing it. So this will fit a little longer. I know this because I have this in gray and a green color and it's just a good wardrobe staple. You can get this from anywhere. It does not have to be from Maritzia, but I just love having something simple like this in my wardrobe. It's cropped, but I feel like just at the right length this one hits me below the belly button um, and doesn't show too much of like the back so pretty happy about that simple basic comfortable that's it we love it this is the cozy fleece mock neck sweatshirt in the color heather warm taupe i have on what is this i have like the boyfriend cozy fleece sweatshirt on now and I love that this is a mock neck top. I was looking for like mock neck sweatshirts, like a like a champion brand or something, and I couldn't really find anything. So I, I when I saw this on the sale, I just had to pick it up. It also has pockets, which I'm excited about, and it's an oversized fit, and I just feel like this will be something really cozy for like working from home and just like lounging around. I'm just <laughs> Oh my gosh, that neck is tight. 
So I definitely had like a little bit of a rough time putting this on. I got this in a size one and it's like that weird sizing where it's like one, two, three. The sleeves are a little short the way it's cut on my sleeves. I do like the sleeves to go a little longer. The way the stitching is right here, like it's making the sleeves feel super short. I'm actually not in love with the way that it's fitting even though I love the color and I love like the concept. It doesn't look as cute as I envisioned. If you have any thoughts on this one, let me know in the comments if I should keep this. But if I have to ask for your opinion, I probably shouldn't keep it. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to keep the tags on this one and look into returning it. I do like the pockets though. They're pretty cool. Here is the Traverse Heather Dover Gray turtleneck. And I've had all my eye on this turtleneck for a while. They had a white one. That I was interested in but it did look a little see-through in the models picture so I decided to go with the gray and already right off the bat it's a really cozy feeling fabric it's super soft I got it in a medium for a little bit of an oversized fit and just a cozy gray turtleneck um, pretty basic I like like the thicker rib detailing yeah I think this was a good choice and kind of like a staple piece maybe feels so cozy, it's almost like pajamas. I put my red top back on for this final item because I think they'll look really good together. But these are the Wilfred Alana pants in peppercorn gray. I got them in a size four tall. So I actually own a pair of the Alana pant in a lighter gray, but that was before they released their tall version. So it almost fits me in length, but it does stop a little short, um, like a little below the ankles, but I like my pants to go all the way to the floor. And I figured I would try out this tall version. I was originally going to buy a pair of the, oh my gosh, what are the popular pants called? Effortless pants, but I own the black ones and I ultimately decided against it because I don't 100% love the length of them and also they are super baggy and not very flattering like on the back so I figured I would try these ones these have a elastic waistband on the back so it might be a little more flattering on some people I feel like it's kind of giving Christmas dinner with the family much more form-fitting than the effortless pants and I really like the length on these and these are pricey pants they are not cheap if pants are over $100, that's an investment and you better make sure that you're going to wear them multiple times. So that has been everything that I picked up for the Aritzia Fall 20 Fall Winter 2022 clientele sale. If you ended up buying anything from the sale, let me know in the comments. To be honest, I really only try to shop there when things are on sale. But if you're interested in similar hauls and cleaning videos, be sure to subscribe.